Welcome to Should I Watch This, where I look at the pilot episode of a TV show and decide bingeable or skip it. This time we are looking at Stingray. I have no idea what this is. I think the Andersons put it together based on when I get this as a reaction request. I don't know if it will be live action, puppets, animation, just stills of models. I'd be totally fine with that considering how good the model work is usually going to be on these shows. So this is a commentary. It is not a market substitute. Please support the original and no spoilers in the comments just in case I react to it later. We are about to launch. Stay okay, we got puppets. Oh. Is this a submarine? Well, that's a thumbs up. <laughs> Just need to see that 30 seconds. <gasps> I love it when they do the buildings going down. Oh my, what is going on? I love this. Another submarine. And there's little tiny fish. <gasps> dun dun dun! It's always a bigger fish. They look like the creature from the Black Lagoon. Are they the main villains of the series? If so, I'm here for it. <gasps> World Security Patrol. Okay. This is a job for the wasps. Alert the, the wasps. Wild Aquanaut Security Patrol. I love their chairs. Here we go again. It's okay, Captain. I'm wide away. There has got to be a Stingray bass toy out there somewhere. Automatic bosun operating. Okay, phones, let's go back to the relaxation bay. We haven't got another instrument check for half an hour yet. <laughs> <laughs> he just takes any opportunity to nap, doesn't he? Oh, nice. Can I live there? That's like perfect. By the ocean, nobody around. Gorgeous furniture. When can I move in? And clearly his wardrobe is amazing. I love everything about this. I'm team ocean creatures right now. Plus, look at this. Look at this design. So much cooler. I mean, Stingray's great. But does it look like a fish? And does it shoot missiles? I think not. <laughs> Panic's over. <laughs> it's just a fish. A big one, but it's only a fish. And I thought we were going to see some action. Warnings. Seal all watertight doors. We're going out of control. Oh no! These aquatic people are awesome. They carry a standby set. That means only one thing. Trouble. With a capital T that rhymes with... Oh, and that stands for ocean! All civilian personnel to remain in their quarters. We have civilian personnel here? Why? Is it like spouses or something? They had them on the 1701D Enterprise. Sweet. I mean, that's one way to keep the civilians safe. Oh. <sighs> Hello there. I love the chiffon. None of her race know the luxury of words. I am Titan, leader of the underwater city of Titanica. Titanica. I mean, Triton is an actual sea god. Titan is usually referring to, of course, the Titans. I do enjoy the decor. Little hint of sparkles. Our job is to investigate, not to fight. Maybe so. But we'll soon find out. I'm gonna give it to you straight, Atlanta. 
We're going to bombard the entire area with... Her name is Atlanta? Missiles. But, Father, we can't do this. Supposing Troy's still alive. Prepare hydronic missiles for launch. I think you should probably be listening to Atlanta and not being like, they started it. Well, I'm pretty sure we started it as Terraniums dumping stuff in the ocean. Whoa. That is neat. When the liquid fills the tube, one marine minute will have passed, and the trial will be over. One marine minute? That looks like a little longer than a regular minute. No fishy, look over here! Look over here! I do like that they're showing sweat on the puppet. <laughs> well, she probably sees this as her ticket out of here. It is decreed that you are doomed to die. You will be taken to the underwater prison of Aquatraz, where <laughs> sentence will be carried out. I'm sorry. Aquatraz. That was good. Going to Aquatraz. It's never not going to be fun. Nice people. They only bother with the big fish. It's okay. She can't talk. Well, maybe not. But the point is, can she understand? Very Planet of the Apes for her character. Oh, don't tell me she's gonna tie those ropes any tighter. She's untying me. What's the action? Don't worry, we'll take care of you. One move and you're dead. Thanks, Marina. Could it be Troy? What in thunder is that? A fish, sir. <laughs> I know that you done the head, but have you ever seen one this size? Launch underwater interceptors. Humans. This is exactly what happened with the Misterons. Did you learn nothing? It sure was some experience. And all I can say is, Ooh, I'm sure glad we happened. made it before the rocket attack. At least we know now what we're up against. Where's Marina? Old races of people living under the sea. Oh, good. Commander Shore? So she's like Lieutenant? kind of a mermaid with legs then? Because she can swim around underwater? As I were saying, at least we know what we're up against. Well... I certainly know what I'm up against. Or, I mean, you could just go for Marina and forget about Troy. I'm just saying. <gasps> oh! I like that they showed her swimming. No, 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 go back to Marina. Go back to Marina. Thank you. So she's basically Little Mermaid. Got it. Now those are credits worth watching. It looks like they are setting this up for a love triangle. But I'm so, so sorry, Atlanta. You can't compete with Ariel, basically. I mean... <laughs> Although, in the original story, the princess got the prince and Little Mermaid died. I absolutely love the design of this show. The submarines, the sets, the costumes. Sylvia, you outdid yourself on this. Outdid yourself. And then all those tanks with the little fish in them. I do prefer the Captain Scarlet puppets. They're more realistic looking. You can almost pretend they're actors. These are very definitely stylized. It's not bad, it's just kind of more in your face that we're watching a marionette show and less, oh, this could be real. Marina's dress though. Can we get this sized up in real life? Obviously this is a thumbs up show. If you're wondering, are you going to react to the whole thing? I don't know. So part of why I do should I watch this is to see what happens when I upload an episode to YouTube. Thunderbirds, for example, is a nightmare to get unblocked. It usually takes seven to eight re-edits. You probably see it has some really intense watermarks on it as well. I won't know that until I upload it to YouTube because every single show is different. If it passes that test of just 
being unblocked and you're able to watch it, then it would be waiting for a slot in the schedule. Now, this would probably, I'm guessing, be on Saturday. We are in the middle of Captain Scarlet and the Mistrons right now. And then I want to try and do the newer Captain Scarlet, which I think is CGI. I've been trying to avoid any spoilers on the newer show. So this would be after the newer Captain Scarlet if we were to do reactions. So it will be a while. But I have a queue of shows I would like to react to that this is definitely going to be on. If you made it all the way to the end of this video and want to let me know in the comments, the code word for this episode is Aquatraz. <laughs> so just put Aquatraz in the comments.